Assalamualaikum and good day to my panel 1 and panel 2 My name is Ahmad Hanzala bin Hani I'm from 3BA1-2 My supervisor name is Puan Rohaina binti Ja'far My co-supervisor name is Encik Arman Hadi bin Adha Today I will present about my Bachelor Degree Project 1 uh, My title is Piezo Electric Generation at Pedestrian for Street Lamp Application okay, This is my content of my presentation Consists of problem statement, objective and scope, background theory, literature review, methodology flowchart, expected result and conclusion. Okay, problem statement. Increasing global consumption of electric energy over the year may contribute to global warming. Therefore, we have the option to choose green energy approach which can be used to minimize energy source from the natural world. Piezo electric is one of renewable energy that is easy to reproduce in electricity. What people normally do in their life, daily life is to walk. There is a dynamic comparison on every step to take. And it is very useful to use without knowledge of it. Pedestrian is one of place that is always been busy. Instead of working without produce anything, physical electric power can be used to generate energy and supply it for the street light at the pedestrian passage. The aim of this project is to provide such a backup power source and to recharge storage device such as battery and capacitor for lighting up the street light when needed. It is also can minimize the chemical waste generated by replacing battery. This is also contribute to lowering the maintenance cost. The main goal of this project is to develop a project that use the function of piezoelectric to generate energy and storage it into storage circuit to evaluate the amount of energy that can be produced through piezoelectric sensor for LED usage. The scope of this project is to develop a system of electricity generating using piezoelectric by applying at pedestrian that can produce electricity, analyze the amount of energy that can be produced through electric piezoelectric sensor for LED usage, develop the prototype design and usage demonstrate for the pedestrian. This is the background of the piezoelectric. In 1980, Jacob Curie and Pierre Curie found that stress can produce electric, electrical charge in a certain crystal such as tourmaline and quartz. The development of piezoelectric has attracted much interest in European scientific community and piezoelectricity has formed as a new field of study in the last decade of 19th century. Today, modern technology with a piezoelectric phenomena are being produced and used in diverse fields such as medicine, engineering and robotics. The energy generated from piezoelectric can be stored in a battery. Piezoelectric effect is an ability of certain material to generate an electrical charge when applying the mechanical stress. A piezoelectric crystal is placed between the two metal plates. The material is balanced and does not conduct, conduct any electric current. However, when the mechanical pressure is applied to a material at the plate, the atom will be moved and immediately be the, the crystal will produce a voltage and current as shown in a figure below. Piezoelectric is a process of using crystal to convert mechanical energy into an electrical energy. The unique of characteristic about piezoelectric effect are that it is that is reversible. That means that the material with a direct piezoelectric effect also show the converse piezoelectric effect. This is the figure of uh, Pierre Curie 1908 and Jacob Curie 1926. Fizzo effect on crystal. Okay. Figure A display about piezoelectric material without stress or charge. Figure B when the material is compressed, the voltage between the electrode is of the same polarity as the polling voltage. Figure C a voltage opposite tension is produced when stretched. D. Conversely, if a voltage is applied, the surface will bend. The material will expand with the opposite polarity of the polling voltage. E. The material with a voltage same polarity will compress. F. The material vibrate at the same frequency as a signal. An AC signal has been applied. Next is comparison literature review. 
These are two or two paper that are using piezoelectric for their project. Next is flow chart pro flow chart project. This task flow chart describes the entire process flow in order to achieve the final target. The project is split into two sections, software and hardware research. The first thing to do to complete the to complete this project successfully is documentation of this project. In this document consists of project briefing, work plan, literature review and data collection. Literature review is the stage is which is de de details research from the previous project. It also discuss the history of this project of this piezoelectric, the product of energy provided by the previous project and method used for this project to complete. The next part will discuss the related component and software used for this project. For this section, the correct component and software for the project has been chosen. The next step is designing a model for this project. To achieve the purpose of this project, the model for the prototype needs to be complete. The type of circuit that can be used in this project must be specified and all components shall be filtered to the pedestrian environment. Next is methodology flowchart. Methodology flowchart starting from the research about the topic, analyze the information, making decision and then separate into three parts. There is mechanical part, electronic part, software part and then it will end with the combination of mechanical, electronic and software part. Component part of this project. There is four component, main component in this project. First is piezoelectric sensor, diode, battery lion and Arduino Uno. Piezoelectric, the component has has high pressure and lasting power. It has also a rather small size which contribute a lot to this project. Need to connect in a parallel connection for more output. Next is diode. Diode IN4007 are usually used to design a bridge rectifier. It has a maximum rating of voltage that is 100 volt and 1 amp output current. Diode is also used to prevent current from flow backward. Next is battery lion or lithium battery. It delivers an excellent level of efficiency. The advantage will be greater if the great if the battery charge correctly. It will have the best perform and longest operation life. Lithium ion battery has higher energy density and cheaper manufacture. Next is Arduino Uno. The function of Arduino in this project is to collect data input voltage and to count a step human that quark on it. In this project, the input is based on piezoelectric sensor analog reading and the output will display in LCD. This is gun chart of this project starting from week 1 until week 15. Next is expected result from this project. The expected result from this project is the piezoelectric power generation can produce the electric power that can be supplied to the pedestrian lamp. Second, to achieve the aim of this project with the energy converted from mechanical energy to electrical energy and store it into the battery and capacitor. Last but not least, the important things that happen when this project is success, that is, it can reduce the chemical waste and practice the green energy lifestyle. Next is list of reference. This reference that I have used to complete my project. And that is that's all from me. Thank you.